your bimbo tasks. <laughs> Let's see, we've done regular slave tasks. We've done himbo tasks. But now it's time for bimbo tasks. For all you sissy sluts and just big old bimbos out there. <laughs> Before we get into like the good good tasks, we're gonna start with the simplest one, which is to like this video, subscribe to my channel if you're not already, and hit that bell icon to turn on notifications for my channel so you get notified every time I upload a video or go live on my channel because for some reason subscribing isn't enough. <laughs> good girl. Your second task is to go grab a pen and paper because I'm gonna want you to write these tasks down because some of them you're gonna do later and there's just gonna be a lot of tasks and it's just, it's just that bimbles are forgetful and dumb. So if you don't write it down, you're gonna forget. So go grab a pen and paper, pause this video if you need to. I'll wait. Task number three. I want you to be doing 30 minutes of yoga every day for one week. If you like, you can do it more than one week, but I think for the next seven days, I want you doing yoga for at least 30 minutes every day, stretching out, getting nice and limber, because bimbos need to be flexible. It's important. Don't you want to be able to put your legs behind your head like a good girl? So yes, yoga every day. Time to get limber, time to get flexible, time to loosen that body up. Good, good slut. girl. Task number four. This is, this is what's really, you really need to write this one down. So you're going to go to the store and you're going to pick up a few things if you don't already have them in your bimbo collection. So first, I want you to get both pink and red lipsticks. I feel like everyone's makeup collection needs at least one pink and at least one red lipstick. Any pink and any red you'd like any brand you'd like, whatever calls to you, whatever makes you feel drawn to it. Just pick that out. One pink, one red lipstick, one eyeshadow palette. Make sure there's a blue in there. Make sure there's like a, like a shimmery white or silver in there for highlighting. But any eyeshadow palette you want, whatever calls to you, whatever speaks to you, whatever, whatever seems like it just fits your bimbo sona. Uh, you also need to get one mascara and one eyeliner because every girl needs those things. They are a must-have. I recommend black, but you can you can get a little creative if you want to go brown or something, but I feel like black's really the way to go. Blush to make sure your cheeks look nice and rosy and flushed. A pink nail polish so you can get your nails nice and done. Toes if necessary and a pair of pretty pink panties, like a good girl. <laughs> mm. Your next task, task number five, I want you to dress up and post a pic on Instagram or Twitter using the hashtag Jules Bimbo. Or if you don't want to post it to Twitter or Instagram, you can post it to my subreddit. Uh, there should be a link for that in the description below. Um, yeah, I can't wait to see all of your bimbo pics. If you want, you can hide your face, I guess. But I think it's more fun if you show your face. Get some exposure. You know you like the attention. <laughs> Task number six. I want you to create a vision board dedicated to your bimbo sona. I want you to put up some of your favorite bimbos throughout history on there. And I want you to, every day, I want you to look at this vision board and I want you to just to picture yourself as your idealized version of your bimbo, of your inner bimbo. And just like see yourself completely bimbofied. Uh, examples of good uh, bimbos that you could put up on your vision board, maybe Marilyn Monroe, uh, Anna Nicole Smith, Wonderful, bimbo icon. Uh, and let me know in the comments who you think of when you think of a, like a ideal bimbo. Who comes to your mind? What woman through history do you think, yeah, that's the bimbo I wanna be? Let me know in the comments. Number seven, I want you to look up some like 
bimbofication hypnosis or bimbofication subliminals and I want you to listen to them and just feel yourself becoming a bigger and bigger bimbo. I even have some mp3s if you go on my night player you can find for sale to help you with the bimbofication process. Uh, no worries for bimbos is one I highly recommend but you know it doesn't have to be mine just any bimbo subliminals, bimbo hypnosis mp3s, bimbo meditations whatever just to help you get into that perfect bimbo mindset. Number eight, I already told you to do. Oopsies, went out of order. And that's to leave a comment with your favorite bimbo icon. That was number eight on my list. But I already worked that into something. Oopsies, I wrote this list like a week ago and kind of forgot what was on it. <laughs> All right, <laughs> task number nine. I want you to pee sitting down. I want you to sit down when you pee. I want you to put the toilet seat down and I want you to sit down and pee like a good girl. <laughs> Mostly for my own amusement because I think it's funny. <laughs> Do it. Pee sitting down. Go, good girl. <laughs> Finally, task number 10. I want you to go to patreon.com slash goddessjewels and you know, Maybe consider subscribing to my Patreon because it helps support my channel. Patreon.com slash goddessjewels, link in the description. Um, and thank you so much. Those are your bimbo tasks. I can't wait to see the comments of your favorite bimbos. Can't wait to see those pictures of your bimbified self. <laughs> like, subscribe, do the things, follow me on socials. Thank you guys so much. And have a beautiful bimbified day. Bye, puppets. Thank you so much to all of my patrons. But a special big extra thank you to Jeffrey Hook and Desiree. Thank you so much for helping support my channel and making these videos possible. Mwah.